We talk a lot about being skeptical of emails that ask you to be part of a survey or to click on a link. So when our verified team got a question about whether the Census Bureau was sending emails to ask about COVID, reporter Bob Siegel decided to check it out. 2020 was a census year, so you probably got a flyer in the mail or a knock on your door reminding you to fill out your census form. But Jackie recently got an email and she was concerned. She asks, is the U.S. Census Bureau asking for info concerning COVID? And she wondered if it was legit. We checked with the U.S. Census Bureau and can verify this email does appear to be from the census. And it's asking Jackie to fill out the new Household Pulse survey. That's how the Bureau is collecting information about how the pandemic is impacting families. It asks about work and school, how you use the stimulus payment, and even attitudes about getting the vaccine. You can already see some of the initial results online. So how do you know if that text or email asking you to participate are real? Here's a few things to look for. Any email will come from at census.gov and a text about the Pulse survey will come from number 39242. If you get those, check that any links really do send you to a .gov address to fill out the survey. Neither the email nor the text will ask you to send any personal information. And remember, the Bureau may ask a lot of personal feeling questions, but it never asks you for social security or bank account numbers. So we can verify, yes, the U.S. Census Bureau is sending out emails and texts asking folks to participate in a survey about the pandemic. If you see something on social media you'd like us to check out for you, send us an email.